Good morning, everyone. We're gonna take Miko to the Oregon coast and I'm so excited to share what I'm gonna be bringing for Miko. This is his first time. I mean, it's only an hour away from the coast. This is gonna be a long drive usually. We don't take him in really long drives like this. So this is our first time and I'll show you what I'm gonna be bringing for him. Let, him, let me get him his room first because he is bothering me. I'm gonna be bringing this Amafi tote bag and putting his stuff in there. So I actually made a list for Miko because like I said, this is our first time going to the coast with Miko. We don't really know what to expect, but the first thing we for sure need is towels. So I have these, let me show you really quick. Let me back you up, let me back you up. So I have a to-do list on my notes the first thing is a water bowl and let me find his water bowl. Where is it? I had it. So <laughs> here's his water bowl and you can take it out like this. It's just easy if you go, if you like going on um, hikes and stuff and then you just clip it on the leash. Uh-uh, he's grabbing, grabbing shit. Here's his water bowl, I'm bringing that. And then um, water bottle, this is his water bottle. Look how cute it is, his water bottle. And then, ooh, I need to get his long leash and we have a 30 feet long leash. He's not trained on recall yet. We're gonna train him when we get to the coast and it's really, if you want to train recall, they say it's good to have a, a, 30, long, a 30 feet uh, leash. That way you can easily grab the leash if you need to. Oh, a frozen peanut butter bowl. So I froze this in one of his bowls, I put peanut butter, water, blueberries, and like some peanut treats. So I'm gonna bring that, can't forget that. Um, this will help him stay occupied for t uh, 15 to 25 minutes, hopefully. And like I said, the drive is only an hour long, but still I just want him to be occupied for a long time. And then I got his treats. We have his teething stick in here, some peanut butter bites and some treats in there for extra, extra stuff. We brought his lunch. He's dragging his water bowl. We brought his lunch so he can have lunch there. And I'm bringing his uh, slow feeder. All of this is from, my, from Amazon, so I will link I'll, I'll link my Amazon storefront in the description box. It's always linked down there. So, and I have a specific category for like dog, all the dog stuff that we got. I'm gonna bring some of his toys. So this is his Chewy toy. And then he really likes this rope and this rope, tennis ball and a thrower. <laughs> and then, um, yeah, we're gonna bring this for the beach. I'm gonna bring poop bags. Um, our fanny pack with our treats in it. I need wipes. I'm gonna bring the wipes. I'm bringing his towels. I'm bringing two towels. And then this chewy spray just in case because he really loves blankets. So if he starts chewing on our like picnic blanket, I'm just gonna chew or spray this so he doesn't chew on it. That's about it. Like that's about it. And then for us, for Brandon and I, we just got our snacks. And then I need to bring my tripod because I wanna do some TikTok videos and bring my vlogging camera, of course, and I'm gonna take you along and I'm so excited. So this is the long leash, actually. I'm rolling it up. I think he's playing with it. This is really, really long, but I just want him to be free, but somewhat for us to be in control of him because, again, he he's not trained on recall yet. He knows his name, but... He's not good with like, when you call him the first time, he doesn't come. We're gonna practice that at the beach. <laughs> so crazy. You need a chill out, girl. Um, excuse me, sir. You can play with this. Play with that.
Target. It was like 50% off. So it was like a dollar something. What, what kind of candies the are they? Tid, the gummies. Tidbits, gummies, wildberry. Try it. Mmm. Not good for you, but. Is there fiber in it? Yes. Damn, it's just gonna make us. Don't eat too much. How many fiber? How many grams of fiber? Like the whole thing? Yeah. Thir 13 grams. Wait, not eat all of it then? <laughs> okay, okay. Stop right there? Yeah. We'll stop right there. <laughs> it's like some probiotic candy. It is. That's what it said. <laughs> it's good though. Not bad. We also got uh, this flavor. Don't need those old, you know, that's, the tropical citrus. That's gonna like, that's like eating like a can of beans kind of, kind of candy. And well, it's probably, of oh, well. course, oh, yeah. we got these chips. Like, these are the best chips ever. And then, uh, Brandon, uh, put this in the freezer last night, so it's super cold. So it'll be good. Like, by the time we're coming back, it'll be perfect. Tropical citrus. The best bottom water. The best. And then, gotta have these. Those the, are the ones I really want. These are my favorite. The very, very trolley, trolley? Sour candies. They're not even sour, but. We're gonna have those ones right now. I like them right now. Okay, soon. <laughs> okay, October. question. Uh, what is the most difficult difficult of having a puppy? Did you ever have puppy blues? The most difficult is when Shaky. Like he's potty trained, but sometimes he can't if he's like, playing too much, he can't help it. And he'll just like have to stop what he's doing and get a like he's gonna have, he's gonna pee or poop like on a spot. Like if he's distracted, he's just he's just chilling with a sack. Chilling? Yeah, sack. Okay. Nope. Just He's, to, he's like a baby, so he, he can't really regulate. Well, he, needs, he, he knows when he, if he's just sitting with us, he knows when he needs to go to the bathroom. But if he's playing, he's kind of, it's like you gotta like be watching out, make sure he doesn't go to the bathroom. Yeah. So when he plays, he wants to like nibble on you and like, you have to like redirect him to toys and like calm him down and then it works. We calm him down, but he just wants to be rough. Mm -hmm. And then, you know, just when he's playing. Did, did but he's have... really well trained though. He like listens really. If you have, if you have a snack in your hand, he'll do anything. He's we very say. food motivated. He'll do anything we say we got a treat. Yeah. We give him, I, I don't even know why he's a hungry all the time. He even treats all the time. Like he non stop getting treats because he's motivated that way. But, did you but, ever have a uh, puppy blues? No, not like I didn't. It's not, and I never had the feeling when I didn't want to have him anymore. Mm -hmm. It just was like you're annoying me. Like, <laughs> it, was like, it was like you're really annoying me. Like if, it, if he's really good in his crate, he likes it. So if we put him in there, I don't feel bad because he like he kind of likes to go in there by himself anyway. And then okay, for me, I had puppy blues in the beginning. Like Is I would say, this, yeah, I, I think the second week, right? Or was it even this? It was it even a full second week? It was like. A week after we got so it was like the beginning of the second week. It was like, yeah, and still in the beginning. And I, because we changed his diet, so he had like diarrhea two nights in a row, and that is like exhausting. And then that's when I was like, what the heck did I get myself into? Like, and I told her it's I, gonna, gonna come and go. It's like, this is my life now. It, but then. Once we change his diet and he, like his poops are solid and like he's like he's really great in the crate like first day like he was always what's that on my face? I don't we felt so bad. I felt so bad. But for him when he had I just him. felt bad for him. But then now like this is our life and I'm so used to having him in our life and now like I can't imagine like my life without him. Um, he's like he is our baby. No, and like when he comes home, when we come home, he's just like so happy to see us. I know. And like we just, he just does anything. If, he's we, just if, we, the if we move across the couch, he'll come over to just a bit hang out by us, like just to bother us. He's just the cutest thing ever, and uh, we're so obsessed with him. And we always look at his old videos, and he was so small, and he's he's growing so fast. And he's like 35 pounds now. Yeah. And he was 20 when we got him. He was he was big. We thought he was big when we got him. Mm -hmm. Because he was bigger than his sisters, but now he's 35 pounds. He's like, okay, he's actually kind of big. So if you ever um, have a puppy, like you get a puppy, and or you experienced getting a puppy, then you understand like puppy blues and like just thinking about, oh, what the heck did I get myself into? Like, like that will like that's why they call it puppy blues. Like you'll pass, and you just you, now you just can't live your life. Without like him. once they get to routine, and like yeah. The, and you gotta, now like, we have like a routine with him. Like we know what to do and. Yeah. He yeah. had to go to the bathroom more when he's like when he was like first when he first got him, but now he's like almost four months. So basically, he's basically four months now. Mm -hmm. 
Oh shit, yeah. He's almost done with the frozen thing. to the coast and so you know how we gave him the frozen frozen peanut butter frozen with like I added water it's like basically a popsicle for him he finished it in 20 minutes and then after let's say 10 minutes he peed in my car so he peed so much we didn't we didn't think about like all the ice all the water will make him pee like he won't be able to hold his bladder because of all the ice that he was um licking yeah he peed in my car so we had to go to the side and i had to put him like all the way to the back like all the way to the back yeah it was like so long it felt like the 30 minute drive felt like freaking an hour because he kept trying to go back in the middle like you know where um he was before but no did not let him so right now we're at this grass area hopefully he can pee or like poop or whatever and then go to the beach because i'm just excited for him to see the ocean and experience the beach miko you peed in my car now when we get home we need to clean up my car he's just sniffing around water bottle right now he's eating his lunch I would say I would give like going to like going to the coast with Miko I would give it a six because he kept trying to eat sand and kept trying to eat the seaweed he kept trying eating um, the crab like the dead crab but he freaking loved he freaking loved the water and he tried like biting the water every time the 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 wave would come I'm giving it a six because he peed in my car and but that's our fault because we didn't realize like licking all the ice will you know obviously will fill up his bladder and he just couldn't hold it he peed in my car um but brandon cleaned it up and we just ate a late lunch we had a chorizo bowl and some chicken now i'm full and i'm i just want to relax watch some youtube videos and he's taking a nap he did take a nap going back home like he took a nap right away so he napped the whole ride back home but going to the coast he was spazzy and insane so i had to go in the middle seat and like just have him not jump in the middle seat because he already peed in there overall it was a pretty good day just like the part where he peed in my car was like oh my gosh like and he peed a lot in there he just couldn't hold it he pooped he pooped on the beach though he pooped a lot at the beach and thankfully he did pee oh my gosh it was so funny because he started peeing like by the water and then the water was coming and then 
the water like hit him and then he didn't end up finishing his pee so he went back and then he finished his pee it was so funny i'll just show you like a bunch of clips on the side so you can see like how fun he had we were only there for an hour and a half now i'm gonna write in my gratitude journal watch some youtube and just relax for a little bit like usual routine because usually we like to go to Trader Joe's like on Sunday mornings but it is Saturday evening we are currently feeding Miko I want to get some ground turkey because we are gonna make or Brandon's gonna make spaghetti and I forgot what I was gonna say oh I took a nap I took a nap earlier because I was just so exhausted from like going to the coast and then coming home and then me took Miko a bath like he was stinky he needed that bath like it's been almost a month since he had a bath but we're not gonna wait that long next time. I know we're not gonna wait that long like, next time but we just waited until like we went to the coast so that way he could just like wash everything off and I think like my body felt sore after that and then I just like felt like so sleepy and tired and just relaxed in bed and took a nap. So we're gonna go to Trader Joe's. I'm also craving for a pizuki. It's been so long since I had like a pizuki. If you don't know what a pizuki is, like with ice cream and a, a warm cookie, it's so freaking good. You wanna hear that sounds good? The, like the, the cinnamon molasses cookies with the cookie butter ice cream. There's like the fall theme, both of them. Ooh, we could have like a fall theme one. It's like fall theme. Yeah, yeah, yeah. fall theme. It's, it's like the ginger, the ginger molasses whatever. Yeah, we should do that. And, and we could warm it up. We could warm up the cookie. Oh yeah, those cookies are so good too. Yeah, but there's Miko eating his dinner. He's getting so big, and he's getting more red. I think that the bath, the bath is helps because I feel like we got a lot, a lot more baby hair. I know every time we take him a bath, like all of his like baby hair keeps coming out. Long you know. So he's getting he so big. He loves the what? Yeah, he loves the beach. He's so adorable. Great. All right, let's do a quick Trader Joe's haul. Here's a barbecue teriyaki chicken, super yummy. I've never had this before, this country potatoes with uh, mushrooms and green beans. I got Miko this salmon jerky, and then we got three of these um, barbell protein bars. We got two of the hazelnut and nougat. Brandon ate half of this one, and then the cookies and cream. The spicy jalapeno chicken sausages. We got ground turkey and then zucchini, avocado. We got molasses, cookie molasses. And then with the cookie butter ice cream, we're gonna warm this up and then put this on top. It's gonna be so good. And then soy chorizo, got tortillas, spiced chai, bananas. The best chips, they're like Takis, but better in my opinion. And then Mexican cheese, and then onions. So that's our mini Trader Joe's haul. Miko? Hey. Oh, Miko. He's like, he's like, why are you both like cleaning my feet? Like, he's like literally like waiting for it. He's so funny. I'm not rolling. Look at him. He's so proud looking. I love it. I just let him get it, honestly. Excuse me, sir. I'm not going to get this shirt Nico's hair on it because I'm going to let it in the gym probably. So. Sit. Lay. I'm going to have a, um, Miko try the salmon jerky. Up. Lay. Leave it. 
leave it. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I care about you more than I know this. Like he literally cares about you more than he wants you. I'm glad that he just even in the car, it's just fine. Yeah. He was like, so tired. All we need to do is get him on a hike or something and like, it's like, it's like, it's like, it's like literally a toddler. Oh, come on, let's see me now. After we head off, if you have a hard day. You're doing good. I know, I should do that. I like cutting those ones more because it's um, yeah. peanut butter and flour. Yeah. The one at Trader Joe's, they have a big box of the peanut butter bones and they're like three something. Mm. Right next time we go. Yeah. Right now we are training place. So that's his place area. And I'm eating so, and he's not even bothering me. Yeah. If we don't want him to bother us, we tell him place and he stays there. And when we say free, he comes out. Place. Play. Yeah, it wasn't the edge though. <laughs> I know. We got a large because obviously he's still a puppy and he's still growing. By the time he's like his adult, grown, like full grown size, he'll be able to fit like perfectly. Okay, we do last one. Uh, uh, place. Play. He cannot leave until we say F-R-E-E. -E. Lay. Warmed up the cookie, put the ice cream, and we're watching the recent, uh, was it Fast? Seven, ten, fast 10? Fast 10? <laughs> oh my gosh. But movie night with ice cream. Mm -hmm.